Tomorrow, the private company planning to launch a live drone streaming service over the St. Louis sky is scheduled to take flight. New tonight, Five on Your Side's Laura Barczewski found even more residents are now getting involved and in speaking out against the program. Mike, this all started in the Gravois Park neighborhood when SMS Novel Films announced it would be testing out its drone surveillance there. The founder says he's since backed out of that neighborhood, but that has now raised red flags for residents in other parts of the city. Gravois Park resident Sarah Crossley says the idea of drones surveilling their homes and streets has been a major concern for her and her neighbors over the past few weeks. At one point, Part of the proposal to us was that we could be paying kind of an exorbitant amount per hour to have surveillance by drone at request. And to me, that just that felt wrong. That's not how public safety should work. The concerned residents canvassed their neighborhoods, started a petition against it, and worked with their older persons to advocate for a law to prevent this kind of thing. The founder of SMS Novel Films says while they won't be in the Gravois Park neighborhood, they didn't say where they'd be going, only that they have a right to take to the skies. We have to take a stand against unjust laws that contradict FAA uh, that prevent us from being able to fly or to start businesses. Uh, so, you know, again, let the aldermen uh, do what they will. We're willing to communicate. We're willing to help educate because a, a lot of individuals don't know these laws. Alderwoman Alicia Sanye says the measure will be compliant with the FAA. Municipalities have the right to do legislation around anything that it protects people from, protects people's privacy, protects people's safety, protects them from harm. Dutchtown resident Dallas Adams says she's worried her neighborhood could be next as they're right next to Gravois Park and it may make people feel even more unsafe. I mean, when you're in over police neighborhoods, I mean, think of some of the ways that they surveil us. Like they have the towers with the red and blue blinking lights at all hours of the day. Our lights are brighter if there are in uh, lit areas. And I mean, all of that has a an effect on, an, on a human being. So yeah, having a drone just going around uh, your street up and down where you're trying to walk your dog or you're just trying to walk to the store, get to transit could incite a lot of fear. Why are you following me? SMS Novel plans to fly the drones for up to three hours starting at 3 o'clock tomorrow. The founder reached out to me yesterday saying they received threats from people claiming they'll shoot them down. I did not hear back from him on whether or not this will change their plans, but the website says launch is still moving forward tomorrow. Tonight